Today's topic, we tackle about pump down. What is pump down for AC unit, air conditioning unit system for the ship? We tackle about pump down and how to pump down air conditioning unit. And also, why we pump down air conditioning unit on board. Okay, let's go. This is the unit, aircon unit for our ship. Number one, we do number one. Right now, it's running condition. This is number one AC compressor. Why we need to pump down? It's because we need to collect all refrigerant going to the receiver. And then you can carry out maintenance in different parts of the system. First, this is the suction going to the compressor. Then this is the discharge. The one who has a insulation that is the suction this one is the suction then this is discharge GEA compressor but the unit name high air Korea oil is normal at the mid sometimes it's three port from the side glass this is the 67 capacity 67 that is the second stage 100 is the third stage this is the pump it is coupled loop oil pump the center this is the pressure of the oil so right now it's it's newly start it's above seven our temp our pressure on the high side is 18 this is the set point for our low low suction and then this is our set point default set point for our high suction sorry high discharge high pressure this is the reset This is the oil pressure. This is the pressure for capacity 100%. At 6, cut in 6 bars, then 67 is 4 bars. The second stage is 4 bars. This is the crackless heater below the side glass. then this one is the discharge compressor discharge and then the separate separator going to the separator going to the receiver receiver that is the condenser also The medium of the condenser is fresh water from LT cooler. Right now, the purpose of pump, pumping down or pump down is to collect all freon or refrigerant. Specific term, refrigerant. Collect in the receiver. This one is the cooling for the LT. That is fresh water. This below is the receiver. This is the out for the condenser. At the receiver or the condenser, it has a side glass. This one, right now our refrigerant is moving because our, our weather right now is rough sea. That's why moving the purpose of pumping down is to collect on the receiver it means we need to 
shut down this after condenser this one this one is going to evaporator it means you can also this one is going to evaporator then this is the return from evaporator going to compressor that is low side that is from evaporator this one we need to close that valve after condenser so that all freon or refrigerant is collect collected and put it on receiver the receiver collects all refrigerant this one that bulb this one is for bypass if you if you service this dryer filter dryer right now it's first stage and second stage second stage is the 67 percent capacity this one right now i will close this valve after the condenser at the top after condenser this isolation valve that is the side glass side glass so that you can check the flow flow of the system I already closed the valve slightly closed just observe the pressure it's going down while I'm closing the valve okay just wait this valve is this bulb is closed right now the compressor is still running and the pressure is going down okay just wait when the compressor collects all refrigerant if you close that bulb you must carefully carefully watch this or observe this pressure so that this low pressure will shut down your system it must be for the low suction let the low suction pressure triggered and shutting down the system and that's it shut down at the low pressure the low pressure pressure switch activates and we need to observe if the pressure is rising if the indicator or low pressure gauge is not stable it means there is no passing on your valve right now the aircon is shutting down and anti-recycling it means you cannot start your compressor this one it has a 30 to 45 minutes delay before you restart your system okay after that 
45 minutes the anterior recycling is okay then you can start that's it it's already pumped down your system is already pumped down and you can service example you will change oil you need to pump down means you close all isolation valve all refrigerant is already on the receiver then you can proceed on your maintenance okay and then we try to restart okay let's go okay right now we need to start the system after maintenance okay the topic for this one only is for pump down okay we already pump down and then we need to restart again we need to open the one that we closed earlier okay. it is standby the indication is standby it means ready to start but the low pressure low suction pressure is triggered if we open this one that's the time that's the time that the compressor starts because he detects that there is a suction pressure already okay that's it our compressor is successfully running check the oil check the oil and then check the side glass it's full starting to getting lower and lower and then we need to have a ANR or a minutes to stable this system but for this one when you restart the system you know this is stable already and then just observe all alarms is already simulated for this one and then low pressure is low pressure pressure switch is good and it is working good this is also the protection for our compressor oil pressure is six bars good oil pressure is six bars the circle below is the one is the one for oil pressure this is the set point for again this is set point for the low pressure and also differential two bars for differential Okay. That is two bars for differential. Maker of the pressure switches is Danfoss. Fifteen, sixteen, sixteen bars for high pressure. this is it I check the current current drone 5.5 it's good normal suction temperature almost all parameters are normal check the surplus has a flow see there is a small balls inside the side glass this one is the filter dryer side glass 
It's normal. That's it. We check again. Side glass. Right now we cannot check what is the accurate level for this one because our ship is rolling but when the ship is at port you can check if the check what is the level this is high air korea type cr c50 1917 this is the type of our ac unit ac unit on board shell type the condenser is shell type shell and tube type as you can see this is our refrigerant refrigerant maker unitor r404a one bottle is 45 kilograms we will check and open this one non flammable a refrigerant all refrigerant is non flammable all refrigerant that we use is not flammable this one this one is for the liquid at the top is for the gas if you charge charge your AC compressor you can choose gas or liquid I hope this video help you and learn from it. Thank you very much. If you learn from this video, click like, share, subscribe and don't forget to hit the bell for more updates. And Follow us on Facebook, Barco TV. Thank you very much.